what is two dimensional motion of electron the force of a unit positive charge at any point in an electric field is defined as electric field intensity e at the point thus the resulting force on a positive charge q is in the direction of field intensity and is given by f equals to q times e to determine the path of the charged particle in the electric field by newton's second law f is equal to q times e equals to ma equals to m into dv by dt where a is acceleration v is the velocity and m is the mass when the charged particle is electron q is equal to minus e where e is the charge in coulombs on the electron consider a parallel plate capacitor as shown in the figure when distance between the plates is much small compared to the area of the plates the field between the plates can be assumed to be uniform and lines of force pointing in the negative x direction that is there is only one field in the minus x axis since there is no force in the y and z directions acceleration along these directions must be zero thus the only possible direction of electron movement is along x axis e into e equals to m into ax ax equals to e into e by m the velocity and displacement can be given as follows provided the acceleration in x direction ax is constant and independent of time as vx equals to vox plus ax into t x equals to xo plus vox into t plus 1 by 2 into ax into t square an acceleration and velocity respectively ax equals to dvx by dt vx equals to dx by dt now consider a uniform field ex may be a function of distance but is independent of time from minus e into vx equals to m into dvx by dt multiplying the above equation with dx equal to vx dt and integrating minus integrals x x not of ex dx equals to integrals vx v0x of vx into dx the potential v of a point x with respect to point x o is work done against the field in taking a unit positive charge from x o to x thus minus integrals x x not of ex dx equals to v same can be written as ev equals to 1 by 2 into m into v square x minus v not square x if a and b are two points with b at higher potential than a vba is the potential difference and q is the charge in coulombs then q vba equals to 1 by 2 into m v a square minus 1 by 2 into m v b square the above equation is not valid if the field varies with time if an electron starts at rest and vba equal to v va equal to o vb is equal to v its final speed v can be given as v equals to 2 ev by m power of 1 by 2 which is 5.93 into 10 power 5 v power 1 by 2 so if an electron falls in a field of 1 volt starting at rest the final velocity achieved by it is 593 km per second even though the velocity is very large the associated kinetic energy is very small compared with that of an electron due to minute mass associated with it